On March 2020, during the coronavirus pandemic, one Bitcoin was worth $5,000. Fast forward to one years later, in January 2021, Bitcoin is now worth around $32,000. There's a lot of opinions about whether Bitcoin is a fad or if it could ultimately replace currencies online. Many analysts from corporate banks like Citibank believe that Bitcoin will hit a high of $300,000 plus by the end of 2021. Also, various large businesses have now started accepting Bitcoin as a form of payment. Here are just a few. Microsoft, Name Hero, Norwegian Airways, Namecheap, Hostinger, and also Newegg. While nobody knows the future of Bitcoin for certain, perhaps diversifying your e-commerce website to accept a growing currency like Bitcoin might be something you might want to consider. Hey guys, my name is Daryl Wilson and today I'll be showing you how you can start accepting Bitcoin on your e-commerce website using WooCommerce. So I spent a few days tinkering around with various merchants and plugins and I finally found a merchant and plugin that has zero fees, zero transaction fees and also zero withdrawal fees. For this video, I'll be using Coinbase. Coinbase is considered the most secure cryptocurrency exchange in the world. Coinbase has been in the industry for the longest and are held to a very high standard when it comes to security. So let me show you how all this works and then we will add it to your e-commerce website. All right, so let me go ahead and walk you through the process of how all of this works. Now you can use this with any page builder or any WordPress theme. So if you're using Elementor or Flatsum or Divi, you can use any WordPress theme and any page builder. So you can see I have uh, one product in the cart. So I'll go over here to checkouts. And then this is my checkout screen. Now I have also enabled uh, other forms of payments, but you can see right here how I can pay with Bitcoin and also other cryptocurrencies. So if you're a believer in Litecoin or Ethereum, you can accept all of those uh, cryptocurrencies on your website. So what I'll do is just say I have read the terms of service and I will proceed to Coinbase. Now a really cool thing about this payment merchant service is that you can actually pay with Coinbase. So if users already have a Coinbase account, they can check out directly with Coinbase, making it a lot easier and faster. And most people out there that have crypto are using a Coinbase in the United States. So it's a very secure and fast way to check out. However, they can also go ahead and pay with any of these other uh, cryptocurrencies. So they can pay with uh, Ethereum or Litecoin. What is this, DAI? I've never even seen that one before, or even Bitcoin Cash. Now let's just say they don't have a Coinbase account and they wanna pay with something else. They can say, all right, well, I don't have Coinbase, so I'll use, um, I'll pay with Bitcoin. And then they can go ahead and see the amounts. They can copy it, and they also have the Bitcoin address. Now they can also scan this, and that will actually be a form of payment as well. Now Coinbase is actually monitoring this transaction right now. So as soon as the money goes to your Bitcoin account and they receive the payments, they will then redirect the visitor to your thank you page. Now, once Coinbase verifies your payment, your visitors will then be redirected to their order complete. So it is somewhat of a fast process. I use my credit card for this specific uh, transaction just because I don't wanna use actual Bitcoin for it. But that's the overall experience that your visitors will have paying with Bitcoin on your website. Now, let me go ahead and walk you through on how to do this. So I'm gonna take a website with nothing on it, with no merchant service. And by the end of this video, this new website with nothing on it will be accepting Bitcoin. It's a real simple process. So let's go ahead and get started, shall we? Let's, let's do this, let's, let's, let's start the party here. So the first thing you'll do is go to your dashboard and under plugins, you'll go to add new. Now there's a lot of various uh, um, crypto payments and plugins, but a lot of them have massive fees. And I've really done my research and I don't want you guys to get a plugin where they're gonna charge you 0.01% of a Bitcoin because in the future, if Bitcoin goes up a lot, then your fees are gonna be actually more, uh, they're gonna be more expensive than your actual products. So I was gonna use this one and uh, go URL. However, after I saw the fees, I says, well, I can't really recommend this because if Bitcoin goes to 300,000 and they're charging 0.15%, then the fees will be worth more than your products and it'll be a useless plugin. Now, if you scroll down, you'll see Coinbase. So Coinbase Commerce, and this is the plugin that we're going to install. Now you can also uh, find it by typing in Bitcoin and you should be able to find the uh, Coinbase Commerce payment gateway for WooCommerce. So let's go ahead and click on install now. And then let's click on activate. All right, so now you'll see we have Coinbase Commerce installed. Now, if you wanna go ahead and check it out, you can go to WooCommerce and go to settings. Now, once you're here, you'll click on payments. 
and then just keep scrolling down and now you'll see Coinbase, Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. And then you can click on manage. All right, so this is where you're going to enter in all your credentials, such as your API key and your webhook shared. So that's pretty much it for my tutorial. No, I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> I'll walk you through on how to do all this. <laughs> so here, so you see where it says um, you can set one up. Go ahead and click on Commerce Coinbase, and this is gonna open up a new tab, and you're gonna have to make an account. Now, making an account is completely free, and it'll also sync up with your Coinbase accounts. Now, you will need a Coinbase account for this tutorial. So this is coinbase.com and guys, this is the number one most secure and also the fastest and easiest cryptocurrency exchange on the internet. You don't have to take my word for it. You guys can do some quick Google searches and seeing the, you know, what's the best currency exchange and you will probably see Coinbase being listed as number one a majority of the time. Whoops, I got a text message and I forgot to put that off, my bad. So uh, go ahead and make an account, it's completely free and you can also buy Bitcoin and other various uh, cryptocurrencies from Coinbase as well. It's really fast and it's really simple. I'll go ahead and log in really quick to my Coinbase accounts. So this is my current uh, account and it's really simple. You can just click on buy and sell and you can buy any of these cryptocurrencies. It's really fast, it's really convenient. Also, if you wanna send or receive cryptocurrency, they give you, um, uh, you just type in how much you wanna send, you put in the address, and if you wanna receive it, you just go ahead and copy your address and then give it to whoever else to, um, to receive crypto. It's a super easy, beautiful interface, and I think that's why this company is very reputable and always recommended on various blogs and other websites. So uh, once you have created a Coinbase account, we will then go back to Coinbase Commerce. So they're two different websites, all right? Let me just be very clear on that. And then you'll click on sign up. Now you will have to go through the process of making an account. I'm not gonna go through every single step with you, but uh, I already have a Coinbase Commerce account. So just go through the process of making an account. It's completely free, it does not cost you anything at all, and it's also very secure. So I'll go ahead and log in and I'll meet you in the dashboard. All right, so this is our dashboard and this is where you can see your balances of all of your cryptocurrencies. So you'll see your balance of Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, Ethereum, and all this stuff. Now let's just say, all right, Daryl, I made some money on Bitcoin. I wanna withdraw it to my Coinbase account. It's really, really simple. You'll just go over here to withdraw. And you can withdraw it various different styles. So they have US dollar or a USD coin. And there is a 1% fee for that. And there is no way to get around that. Every merchant in the world has this. However, if you already have a Coinbase account, you can withdraw crypto back to your Coinbase account and there is no fee whatsoever for that. So that's really, really cool. They offer this. Uh, the more Bitcoin goes higher, the more your fees are gonna go up. So I think having no fees is the best way to go about all this. So once you do all this, we'll go back to your, um, your WooCommerce uh, settings. You'll see an API key. Now you can get your API key by going to the uh, Coinbase Commerce settings. So let's go over here to settings and we'll scroll down, just keep scrolling, just keep scrolling. They do have also some other options here. You guys can go ahead and check all this stuff out where you can get backup codes and all this other cool stuff. You know, there was one guy actually who had like 300 million Bitcoin stuck on a hard drive and he couldn't get it out. <laughs> oh, that poor, poor soul. So you can see here how I've already uh, connected my Coinbase account. So all my money just goes directly to Coinbase. And then from Coinbase, I can withdraw it back to my bank account. Really, really simple but uh, let's keep scrolling. Oh yeah, you can also uh, take away currencies. So if you don't want, uh, is that die or day? I don't even know how to pronounce that. I've never even seen that. Gosh, I've been living under a rock here. So here you can go ahead and create an API key. So just go ahead and click on create an API key. And then you'll go ahead and copy this. You'll go back to your, um, your dashboard right here and you'll just go ahead and paste it in there and that's it. Now also, you will also need to create a webhook shared secrets. And let's go ahead and do that. So over here, we can add an endpoint. And then you'll go ahead back over here and then you'll see this URL. So it's pretty simple. Go ahead and copy all of this. All right, copy, go back to your accounts and then paste that in there like that and then save it. And once you do that, it's going to generate a shared secret that you can actually put on the website. So this is now the uh, webhook shared secret. So I'll copy this. I'll go back to my website and I'll paste it in there and now you are 100% done. It's that easy. So let's go over here to save changes. Now let's go ahead and take a look. You know, can I ex start accepting a crypto uh, currencies online? Let's go ahead and take a look at my website. All right, so I am on my website and I want to go ahead and purchase, uh, let's see, what should I buy here? Let's buy this gray belt. All right, 
I will view the cart. Oh, I already have products in my cart. Cool. Well, yeah, I'll just leave that in there and I will go to proceed to checkout. All right, let's go ahead and scroll down. Just keep scrolling, just keep scrolling. So now you'll see we have Bitcoin and remember how I changed the actual, um, you know, I changed the description so you can change that to whatever you want. And then here I'll go to proceed to Coinbase. All right, cool. So now we can see our website is connected. So you can see how our URL has changed to commerce.coinbase. So that's how you know it's working. And then we can click on pay with Coinbase or the user can go ahead and pay you right here with Bitcoin and they can make that transaction. Now Coinbase, again, they are monitoring this so they will know if the payment has been sent. In fact, they will let you know that we are monitoring the network for your payments. So they're just making sure that they get the payment before they actually say the transaction is complete. So it's a very secure and fast process to accept Bitcoin on your e-commerce website. So party people, that is pretty much it for my tutorial. Now, uh, one thing, if this uh, interface changes, uh, my apologies, but these websites do have a tendency to change these settings. Also, uh, Coinbase, the interface does change sometimes. Oh, look at my crypto, look at that, Woo, It's going up, but I don't have a lot I actually cashed out, but uh, Bitcoin is going wild. You guys can see it's at $32,000. And it could go to 300K, you know, just give it a few years. And uh, I mean, if you put in like $100,000, you know, it could be worth $300,000 by the end of two or three years. I don't know. Nobody knows. But uh, yeah, so that's how you can go ahead and sign up for um, Coinbase and Coinbase e-commerce. Again, guys, if you have any questions for me, feel free to let me know in the comments below.